Hi everyone, and may I firstly say a very, very happy New Year to you all. And I hope you have a prosperous, happy and very healthy New Year to you, your friends and family. Um, that's it then, first video of 2017. And as I promised, we're going to be using the Fabergé Brute. So who's excited about that? <laughs> I am. <laughs> so here we go. The Fabergé uh, shaving cream. And a lot of people said in the comments, didn't know they did shaving cream. I didn't know they did shaving cream. But they obviously did. And this one has been unused. Uh, there's the tube. You can see Fabergé and uh, I put some in the red mixing bowl, you can see there. And I'm using one of my favourite razors, the Gillette Slim Adjustable. I thought I'd use this the special day, 1st um, first of January, New Year's Day. And uh, there you go. And we're using this on setting number four, this time not five, number four, the dot. You see that? In between five and three. Five and three, that's right. Thought my eyes were going then. Uh, setting four, twist to open, and inside I'm using um, a high stainless feather blade, and that's been used once. So twist to shut. Using a Sunog 830. Ball brush. Are you excited? Because I am. I want to show you the lathering process because this is an old shaving cream and that's been soaking in water. As you could hear, then hopefully I shook it out so it's wet but it's not dripping. And we're going to start to lather up. And uh, while I do that, I'll show you these are orchids. Um, Quite a simple looking thing, but it's quite special orchids. So we'll have a quick close up of them. And because there's not a lot to see in there, I'm going to give you a close up of the box of the Brute and the aftershave lotion I'm going to use um, as well. So take a look at them while I lather up. So there you go, that was the close-ups, and this is the lather. Um, oh. <laughs> Do you remember? oh, I remember now there was a brute soap you used to use in the bath, yeah. And it's that same, the same sort of scent, the brute soap, hand soap, um, brute talc, everything. Oh, and if you thought then, because it was so cheap, really. Um, look at this, how it's lathering up. So you could see how much I used in the bowl. It was a good bit there, really, because I didn't intend that much to come out. I just wanted a little pea size. But it's not, not over the top, because I want to keep this as quite special. Um, but it hasn't lost its uh, scent. Oh, it's that brute scent. Beautiful. Look how, I mean, look at the, Look at this. You can't argue with that for the age of it. Fantastic. Really happy with that. So, not long come out the shower, so I'm ready. And I can't wait. Look at that. Go on, have a sniff to that. Go on. 
Hey, oh, memories. Look at this. Fabergé Brute Shaving Cream. So come on you artisans. Brute aftershave. Uh, yeah. We're going to do a Brute Shaving Soap. And maybe an Old Spice. Similar. Or some do. I know they do a similar. Um, oh, this is beautiful. I'll give you a close-up of what it looks like. Not bad, is it, for its age? It's got to be over 30 years old, this. Absolutely superb. Right. With towel. Even got a brute coloured towel today. <laughs> You've seen that before. Anyway, how has your week been? How's your weekend going? Any bad heads this morning? British time. I know some people are watching this. It may not be New Year yet. Depends where you are in the world. Um, and maybe someplace it was New Year's Day yesterday. I don't know. But, as I said... God, I'm in my element. Happy New Year to you all. Right, that's lovely. This feather's a lovely... Lovely blade, when it's been used once, twice, it sort of settles down. I thought I had then, look at that, just caught myself there. I felt that then. Um, yeah, it's a lovely... It's a lovely blade, especially... This is a nice setting. Setting four. Of this vintage, beautiful condition. Gillette Slim adjustable. And, oh look at this. Just bear with me. Now this is what happens. This is the septic pencil. It broke and this is the end bit. So, I'm just going to, so for any new people in, this is what you do if you cut yourself. It's not a bad cut, and it will hurt. Or sting. Just rub it on. It might take a bit to, to work. You can always add more. And then just let that settle, carry on with the shave. Yeah, so the Brute scent is superb. Uh, it's there, it's not uh, It's not bang in your face, it's not a strong scent. Didn't think it would be, I mean, you've got to give it credit. It may have been when it was new, but the scent is there. Um, it's over 30 years old. Uh, it lathered up so, oh, fantastically quick to a good lather, as you can see. Um, I'll give my thoughts on the slickness on the second pass. But even judging on the first is good. See how that stopped now? So if you're new to this way of shaving, get yourself a septic pencil. Yeah, so I hope you've had a good week. Um, having a good weekend, having some fantastic shaves. And if you've had new products, I hope you're loving them as well. I've got loads to use. Um, in my next video, look at Cartier, isn't it? <laughs> Chainsaw Massacre in this today. This scent, 1980s, bang, straight in my face. 1980, I can smell it now. Oh, 
fantastic. Look at this. I haven't even gone back to the bowl. Absolutely superb. Um, so did you celebrate New Year? And I gotta be honest, in previous years I've never bothered to stay up until um, midnight because I've always about 10, 11 o'clock and <laughs> with being up so early. Uh, but I've watched, I always like to watch the next day the um, the countdown from uh, London, from uh, Big Ben. That's the place to be. As is other parts of the world, obviously, but for you. Um, oh, this is, <laughs> I'm sorry if I'm quiet. This is a special day, special cream. So how that pencils work there. So we do the same here now. And uh, one thing you'll see, some people cut this out if they film, some of them. Not all of them. Um, one thing with making shaving videos, there's no take two. So if something went wrong now, that's it. You know, you can't regrow the beard or whatever. It's in one take generally. And whatever happens, I like to film because this is how it is for everyone, you know. Um, I like to sort of show it if I can. Uh, as if I wasn't filming it, if that makes sense. Slickness test. Let's do a slickness test. Oh, superb for its age. <laughs> Go on, now we'll get some more. La -de -de, double your money and never get rich. Yes, this is lovely. Oh, 1980, this, this, this bath soap we used to have on my father and talc aftershave. It's all there. <laughs> oh, God. And it is different to the modern stuff. I don't care what anybody says. It's, it's, it's something in there. Just, oh. Look at that. I tell you what I'll do for you people who are like wet. I'll just add water. To, I've just added water to the tip. Let's see what happens. Right against the growth which for me is this way. So about there. Even though I've copped it a couple of times, um, it is a feather blade after all, but uh, this is a lovely comfortable setting for five on this razor, for me personally. And you know, people say, well, what's the best setting? You'd have to decide that yourself. It depends, you know, to a degree, what shaving soaps you're using, what your skin's like, what the beard growth's like. Is it thin? Is it coarse? Um, all sort of things. What razor you're using? What blade? How old the blade is? How many shaves? All these little things. And it all changes. All the answers change for each one of us you know it's a uh, but you can have an idea through other people but in honesty to know what works for you it's only you can tell um, if that makes sense uh, oh, I'm just 
I'm in my glory doing it to end. Superb razor, lovely shave. Nice and gentle. I can't believe this. When I'm shaving with this, I can't believe how old this cream is. The slickness is superb. Right, start sideways. Oh, and may I apologise um, for last for the last shaving video going up late, um, as many of you will know by now. If you don't, I had a, a technical issue. Um, I uploaded the video overnight, but the application I use for YouTube. Uh, which was Firefox crashed during the night and um, when I got up to go to work it was too late then I had to go to work so I couldn't do nothing about it and uh, oh, it was annoying so I've had to go back to Google Chrome no issues with that so far uh, I never had issues with Firefox um, before but it's l lately it's just crash 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 so I've you know Come back to Fire, uh, Fire. Come back to um, Google Chrome, which is a shame. I enjoyed Firefox. Uh, I have re, I've deleted it. I've re-downloaded it, if you like, and it's not doing. It's, you know, I don't know. Anyway, so that was the reason, and I had to redo the video, then upload it. So, and thanks for people's concern. <laughs> Even Mrs H was having messages. Is everything all right? And <laughs> so, God, blimey, look at this! Like Freddy Krueger's been here. So that's how you use a septic pencil and it doesn't alter your shave at all. It stops the bleeding and you feel fantastic. So I'm just gonna, oh, we've gotta do pickups. We've gotta smell, have a smell of that. <laughs> you do pickups whether you need them or not. <laughs> well, I do. Right, off we go. There won't be many maybe, I don't know. That's a lovely sound. Right. Oh, Don't mind you. Oh, listen to that. The Adam's apple can be difficult when you first start and you wonder how can I shave that? The way I do it, there's the Adam's apple. Some really stick out don't they but all I do is shave to there and then pull the skin and then shave again and then pull it this side and shave that side. And that way you're shaving it but you're not shaving on the Adam's apple itself because that's a nasty cut if you do that. That is superb, really. Lovely, right. Thank you to the Gillette there. Just rinse off. Slickness the law. Slickness the law. So the drink dry off. And you know what would be nice when I've rinsed the brush, it'll smell of brute. That's lovely. Look at this, I've caught that again. So, I'm glad this is happening actually because I can, not many people show this. Well, some do, but uh, because of the blood, people think, oh no, I can't show that. But it's part of the shave. 
And it is red. Oh. That's good. <laughs> right, that'll do. Okie dokie. Now what will help it, I'm going to use Thayer's Unscented. If you see, it has stopped the bleeding straight away. So these little pencils do work. You can buy them in most chemists. Um, more so in the privately owned, if that makes sense, the uh, chemist shops. What we have in Britain, anyway. That's lovely. That's the thing is unscented. And now for the best thing I could ever wish for. <laughs> Oh, and by the way, I'm not putting moisturiser on in the video. And there's one reason for that, is because I want this as it is. This is how my father would have done it, finished with, he, do, he wouldn't use witch hazel. It'd been rinse, this, scream, and out down the pub. So, <laughs> especially if he cuts himself. So, we're using the aftershave splash, or splash on lotion. Uh, Fabergé. Oh, <laughs> Go on, eh? <laughs> God. Oh, come on. Especially when you remember it the first time round. Oh, it's like magic, that. Honestly, it's like being taken in the TARDIS of Doctor Who back to the... <sighs> Imagine that'd be an idea. Imagine you could stock up on this lot, knowing what it would fetch now. Do you have another one? Oh, this is what it's about. You couldn't do all this with the electric razor, are you? Oh, come on. This is, this is what you call living. This is... <laughs> Look at that. Beautiful. Selfie. So, um... What can I say? I'm not putting much... I'll put it on later on. I just want this scent. I don't want nothing to get in its way. Hopefully you can understand that, but I will put it on later. It is important to put moisture cream on. Um, so we'll have a recap. Using the Gillette Slim Adjustable on setting number four, it goes up to nine. Setting number four, so it's just under half. Um, forgot to mention there is a slight overhang to be aware of. Uh, twist to open using the high stainless feather blade being used once, so this is its second outing. Um, even though I got a few nicks, it's a good blade when it's been used first time, second time. Um, it sort of beds in then, and it's, for me personally, for my skin, for my beard, uh, it could be different for you. But for me, the best shave is the second, third, and so on. Maybe fourth, but I won't use it after that really, unless it feels really good. Um, oh God, I can tell. <laughs> And <laughs> whiff to this, fantastic. Uh, we use the Samoke 830 ball brush, the red shaving bowl, and this creme de la creme. Do you get a shaving cream creme? Uh, Fabergé Brute shaving cream, superb. Over 30 years old, at least, I should think. Uh, this was new, good to lather up. The scent, it is um, like, like a palm olive to look at, green. Um, very quick to lather up, creamy. The scent is there, it's superb. Uh, it has the brute soap scent, if you remember the bars of soap. Um, and it lathered up, it did a lovely slickness, good job, as you can see. Um, I've sorted that out, there was one here somewhere. There's one there, that's been done. So, um, use the Siptic pencil, always have it to hand. 
And what else did we use? Rinsed off with water, then I used the Thayer's Unscented Witch Hazel for reasons I hope uh, are clear because I didn't want anything to get in the way of this. And uh, then, oh, this is. <laughs> God, it's like having somebody in, you know, in the 80s standing next to you when they were going out and they were humming of this stuff, humming of it. And uh, Brute, Fabergé Brute Splash on Lotion Original. And it smells superb, what can I say? Absolutely superb. Um, the spray one I've got, the Eau de Toilette, that's even stronger to me. It's a. Uh, oh, go on, go on, you gotta have a. Eh? Oh, a very memorable shave, and what a day to do it! The first of the year. And um, let's hope it's many, many um, shaves to come of good enjoyment and memory lanes for all of us. So uh, that concludes my first shave of 2017, 2017. And uh, may I say thank you to everybody for all your support during 2016, uh, making this channel what it is. And... Um, making me one of the happiest people you can imagine uh, I love making the videos uh, twice a week um, part of my life now just part of my routine um, but it's never a chore important that on YouTube I always want to make things never do it because you have to make them uh, I think that comes across as well to the viewer myself personally anyway um, yeah so thanks for last year and um, hopefully you'll stay with me this year for many more videos and I hope you have, as I said, a happy, prosperous and very healthy new year for you, your friends and your family. And um, happy shaving as well. Yeah. <laughs> Get out there, try it and uh, fantastic. I got some new products as you'll see or you've seen um, to use. Uh, Next shave will be a new razor. I don't think it's been released yet, or it wasn't when they sent it to me. And a new uh, soap and cologne. And more soaps and stuff after that. So, you know, the start of the year is going to be good. It's going to be different, and uh, hopefully you'll get something from it. Anyway, Paul, just go, will you? Thanks very much. <laughs> Thanks to Mrs. H. And um, I'll see you good people on Wednesday for the midweek shave. Happy New Year.